Uh, welcome to another Substance Sanity tutorial. Today we're gonna see how to create this metallic floor type industrial. It's very easy and this is the the basic texture. You can enhance this with more time. And let's get started. We have the graph here, as you see it's very easy and simple. First we're going to create the pattern. For this we're going to use this mesh one node. You just type here, mesh. And here is the, the node. Once you have the node, you apply uh, tilling 8, you can apply uh, another number, I just use this, 8, and rotate, you set true. Uh, and then you use a uh, Instagram scan. Instagram scan allows us to uh, remove this blur from the pattern. In position I use 0 0.35 and contrast 0 0.65 to a more sharp pattern and this is for the uh, floor pattern then you use this clouds one node and apply on histogram scan Instagram scan allows us to uh, like the levels node as you see this is allows us to to tweak the opacity of this node okay this is the basic pattern then this is the from this node you create the normal Apply a normal node. And we're gonna create a damage from the from the floor. Um BN Bow Spots 2, BN White Spots 2, then a levels node to just leave these uh, spots black spots in the, in the texture then apply a sharpen and sharpen node for uh, more crispy and this you apply another uh, a normal open gear as uh, before and these two we're going to apply a normal combine this allows us to create the normal map with the damage for the floor okay and connect to the output normal then we're going to create the rust the texture grab this and connect uh, invert grayscale Then you bring an uh, ambient occlusion node. Just uh, search here, ambient occlusion, drag. I have these values 0 0.37 is 0 0.26. This is the only values I change. Then bring this dripping rust node. This search dripping, dripping rust. Okay. This uh, node create a mask for uh, dripping rust. Use a curvature map in ambient occlusion position. We are now use here, and a mask. Okay. Here we have the position. It's the same. Search here position. Uh, sorry, uh, curvature. 
curvature map bring here this is uh, this uh, uh, need a normal map we use this the first normal we create connect here with the ambient occlusion and the mask is the inverted grayscale okay and here you can apply the, the rust as you wish as you need you, I have to in the I have the value 0 0.022 if you apply more you see more rust uh, in your texture The, uh, as you wish, as you need, you apply this. Okay, I leave here. Then we're gonna use the. Uh, we're gonna set the color. First, we're gonna grab this first uh, clouds one. Apply a gradient map with the tunnel. Uh, with the colors in blue and green here we can see whether the, the gradient then we are going to blend with a, a black a white note the mask is the uh, clouds in min dark neck mode and opacity 0 0.42 okay uh, kd is to dock then we're gonna apply this gradient map for the rust as you see you can grab a, a image uh, from rust and grab this these colors, this gradient, and we connect this mask here, a dripping rust, dripping rust, the output connect here. Then the H is here for uh, more darkening, color, and blend. Blend. And the opacity is the same, the dripping rust. And that is the our final color map. This is our color map. Color map final have to see this. Then we're gonna create the roughness. The same. Uh, grab this histogram scan. Blend with these two color this is a uh, uh, um, uh, color note and grayscale uh, level uh, 99 and this the same and another uh, color note and value uh, 82 okay these two blend in copy mode then we're gonna apply the our rust to our roughness this is the rust blend mode in add linear dodge and the opacity is the roughness is the dripping rust sorry this is how it must be blend these two, these uh, white spots must be more roughness because it's like a wear of the floor and connect in the output from roughness map and for metallic this uh, white color note okay this is how you have to grab your 
final wrap. It's very easy and very uh, easy to create this graph. Okay, I hope you like this tutorial. If you have any questions, comments, if you want to see some texture in particular, just let me know in the comments below. And if you like, uh, please uh, like, uh, share and subscribe. See you in the next time. Bye, folks.